from the greatest league in the world to the worst league in the world, the WNBA. They're figuring out ways to just completely cut their own legs off again. Um, this isn't a shock. This is actually a little better than what we were expecting. But the WNBA um, is set to lose $40 million this year. There were reports earlier in the year that it was going to be $50 million. They're going to lose $40 million. James, is this... Um, where where do you believe like the league should go from here? Do you think they have a place in professional sports? They're not going anywhere, but do you think they have a place in in, in the professional sports world where we're talking about the NBA and Major League Baseball, NFL, et cetera? Do they have a place in that world? No, they don't. It's very obvious. If you're losing forty million dollars a year when you're playing when you're paying the players absolutely nothing, you know that you are a bad league. And so that, that's the bottom line and you're not paying them anything but the women they want to be paid like the players so instead what i propose is that they should pay the players exactly what they play and pay the male players so that way instead of losing 40 million they can lose 4.6 billion because that's what the players in the nba make so that's what the owners in the wnba should lose 4.6 billion dollars so the NBA owners own 60% of the league, and it's all, all private owners. And a lot of like now it's starting to become some some private ownership w amongst the owners of the league. There's they're they're expanding. So there's a couple things going on. They're going to expand the league. They're going to expand the playoffs. So they're going to add in that will add more revenue. Plus, they're signing a 2.2 billion dollar media deal this year. So like right now, 2.2 billion dollars. So that adds basically 100 million dollars into the league every single season. Who is that fucking stupid to give them $2.2 billion? Nobody watches them. I think you're them. missing this. That's the problem is that you're still in a position that's missing the amount of fandom coming out. The Indiana Fever outdrew the Indiana Pacers. Congratulations. On, they have the one on draw. On average, more people went to their games than the Pacers. More people went to a WNBA game than an NBA game over the entire course of a season, James. Yes, and that's totally uh, cool. But James, when you say these things aren't relevant, these things can't happen, these things aren't going to change anything, they're outdrawing the NBA. But it's a, it's a one-year spike because she is the new hot thing. So, that's the only reason. But this has actually been a trend. That's the problem. This has been a trend. This is growing. Now, it, it, there was a big spike. I'll give you that. There's no hiding that. Caitlin Clark has changed this league. Um, but $2.2 billion coming in, which means it's over $100 million a year. That they, that makes your $40 million loss, James, and makes that a $60 million gain. Um, so when you add on top of that, though, the WNBA players decide now they want to get paid more. They mm -hmm. actually today, or I think it might have been yesterday, um, officially left negotiations, WNBA players, reps, and their their um, union left the negotiation table to ask for more money. So they are uh, starting to do like basically a mini strike. Um, do you think, okay, when you're, when you're adding that money, I get it. You don't think it's viable. You don't like it. When you're adding in that money, does that change things for you? Does that change your outlook on this league? No, not at all, because guess what? That extra $60 million that they're going to make, now these women are going to say, oh, we deserve that because, look, we're helping the league grow, and we, you only got $2.2 billion because of us, and they will get it. They will get it because we're in a woke fucking world, and we have to play nice and make sure that everybody gets theirs even if they don't fucking deserve it. This is bullshit.